Solution Caves The most common cave type forms when slightly acidic rainwater dissolves limestone and similar rocks. Rainwater absorbs carbon dioxide, creating carbonic acid that slowly dissolves calcium carbonate in a process called karstification. Mammoth Cave in Kentucky exemplifies this type, with over 400 miles of surveyed passages. Similarly, Vietnam's Hang Son Dung contains chambers large enough to house a 40-story skyscraper. These caves develop over millions of years as water follows cracks, gradually widening them into passages and rooms. The distinctive formations result from the same chemistry in reverse. As mineral-laden water drips, carbon dioxide escapes, causing calcite to precipitate. Stalactites grow downward from the ceiling, while stalagmites build upward from the floor, sometimes meeting to form columns. Other formations include delicate soda straws, flowing draperies, and bizarre helictites that grow in all directions. Sea Caves Oceanic forces carve sea caves along coastlines through differential erosion. Waves relentlessly pound rock faces, exploiting weaknesses like joints and faults. Over thousands of years, this mechanical action hollows out cavities and cliff faces. In Scotland, Fingal's Cave features distinctive hexagonal basalt columns and exceptional acoustics that inspired Mendelssohn's Hebrides Overture. Sea caves often have smooth, polished walls and strange acoustics from waves echoing within chambers. Most remain accessible only during low tide. Some connect to blowholes, narrow vertical shafts that spray water skyward during high surf. As sea levels change or land uplifts, former sea caves can end up high above current shorelines, providing evidence of ancient coastlines. Sandstone Caves Though sand might seem too soft, Cemented sandstone can support extensive cave systems. Groundwater dissolves the mineral cement binding sand grains, causing the rock to disintegrate in a process called piping or suffosion. Unlike the smooth walls of limestone caves, sandstone caves feature rough, granular surfaces and frequent collapses as ceiling support diminishes. Wind erosion also creates sandstone caves, especially in deserts where sand-laden winds wear down softer rock. Australia's Uluru contains numerous sandstone caves along its base, many holding sacred significance to indigenous Anangu people. These form where layers of varying hardness meet, with softer layers eroding faster to create undercuts. Talus Caves when massive boulders tumble from cliff faces and pile haphazardly, they create void spaces between them. Unlike other cave types, talus caves form chaotic three-dimensional mazes. In California, Pinnacles National Park contains extensive talus cave systems formed when erosion undermined massive volcanic blocks. As supporting material washed away, giant boulders collapsed into jumbled piles. These spaces often maintain cool temperatures year-round as cold air becomes trapped between rocks. Talus caves provide important wildlife habitat for bats, ringtails, and specialized insects. Though lacking spectacular mineral formations, they often contain breathing rocks, where air flows through tiny passages, creating audible whistling sounds. Glacier Caves Within glaciers, meltwater or geothermal heat creates passages through ice. Glacier caves often display stunning blue light filtered through dense ice. The most spectacular form in temperate glaciers where summer meltwater carves complex drainage networks. Alaska's Mendenhall Glacier contained the famous crystal ice cave with electric blue chambers before collapsing as the glacier retreated. Unlike rock caves that persist for millennia, glacier caves typically last only months or years. They present significant dangers including sudden collapse, hidden crevasses, and flash flooding from released meltwater. Scientists study them to understand meltwater flow and how climate change accelerates ice loss. Lava Tubes When volcanoes erupt, lava flows like rivers. The surface cools and solidifies while hot lava continues flowing beneath. When the eruption ends, the molten lava drains out, leaving hollow tunnels. Kazumura Cave in Hawaii represents the longest lava tube on Earth at 40.7 miles. These caves form rapidly, sometimes in just weeks, compared to the millions of years for solution caves. The interior surfaces often display flow marks, lava stalactites, and benches where lava temporarily pooled. Lava tubes typically feature smooth floors, arched ceilings, and round cross-sections. Ceiling collapses create skylights that allow access. On Mars, astronomers have identified lava tubes potentially large enough to house entire human settlements, offering natural radiation shielding for future colonists. Rock Shelters Rock shelters form when cliff faces erode unevenly, creating overhangs. 
wind, rain, and freeze-thaw cycles gradually hollow out softer rock layers beneath more resistant ones. Rock shelters hold tremendous archaeological importance as ideal habitation sites for prehistoric humans. Altamira Cave in Spain contains 14,000-year-old Paleolithic paintings, while Bimbetka in India features art spanning 30,000 years of human history. Protected from rain yet well-lit and easily defended, rock shelters served as humanity's first apartment buildings. Unlike deep caves with constant temperature, rock shelters experience greater environmental fluctuations while providing significant protection. This semi-sheltered environment sometimes preserves artifacts that would decay in open sites, making them invaluable time capsules. Tectonic Caves Earth's crustal movements create tectonic caves when rock masses shift along faults or fractures. These form suddenly during earthquakes when rock blocks separate, creating open spaces. Tectonic caves typically feature straight passages following fault lines, angular rooms with ceiling and wall surfaces that would match like puzzle pieces if rejoined. Initial fracturing creates pathways for water to penetrate limestone, allowing solution processes to enlarge passages over time. Krubera Cave in Georgia, the deepest known cave at 7,208 feet, follows near vertical fault zones deep into a mountain range, combining tectonic formation with water dissolution. Anki Align Caves where fresh water and seawater meet underground, these caves form unique ecosystems in coastal limestone regions. These feature submerged passages connected to the ocean through tiny fissures, allowing water exchange without significant tidal effects. Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula contains thousands of cenotes, leading to the world's largest known Anchialine system. These flooded caves formed during ice ages when sea levels were lower, allowing solution processes to create air-filled passages that later flooded as ice melted. These caves contain distinct water layers, freshwater floating atop denser saltwater with a mixing zone called a halocline, creating strange visual effects for divers. They host highly specialized ecosystems with many endemic species found nowhere else, often colorless and eyeless, evolved in isolation for millions of years. Ice Caves Different from glacier caves, ice caves form in rock where seasonal freezing creates ice formations that persist year-round. These maintain freezing temperatures through cold air trapping, a phenomenon where dense winter air sinks into the cave and remains trapped by its structure. Dobshinska Ice Cave in Slovakia, the ice reaching depths of 80 feet, with the oldest layers dating back 7,000 years. Ice caves feature dazzling formations, ice stalactites, stalagmites, columns, and frozen waterfalls. These caves remain extremely sensitive to climate change. Many historic ice caves have lost their perennial ice in recent decades as warming winter temperatures disrupt the cold trapping mechanism. Scientists monitor them as early warning systems for climate change impacts. If you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.